Hello everybody, welcome back to another very serious player review on the Serious Player Review channel featuring your host Higgins, McHiggins Bottom. Is that my name? Today we have a very serious player review and it's going to involve 82 rated Surge uh G Sir Na Gnab Gnabry Gnab Anyway, Surge you, you pronounce the jam pretty sure. I'm gonna go with Serge Gnabry. He's got a good looking card. He got in the team of the week. Playing for Hoffenheim on loan from Bayern, I believe. Former Arsenal man. I just know this man's entire backstory. He has a interesting looking card. Now this is going for a hefty price at the moment. It's only been out for about an hour or so, but there's a lot of hype built around it, which is why I made this video. So he costs 112K. I don't expect him to stay nearly that price i'm expecting him to drop down to maybe 50k 45k uh, i could see i expect him to be he's in the cal wilson alessandrini that kind of mold where it's like an overpowered player but still not worth heaps of coins anyway if you look at the stats the thing that stands out to me which is negative which is why i don't think he's going to stay at such a high price stamina only 77 strength only 77 i mean it's good for a striker but still only 77 and then composure only 75 that's not very good vision's also pretty low at 71 even though he's a striker vision's not the hugest thing but uh, it's still pretty important finishing's all right 82 shot power is there long shots a little bit low he's got good volleys which uh, everyone does a lot so we've thrown him into this team got some other players here uh, rafael player or ptg was that called path of glory origi campos so yeah you know the boys you know the boys all right i'm gonna try to make this player review quick because the longer i hold on to this card the more coinage i'm losing and at the moment i'm just kind of like leaking coinage that's not the only thing i'm leaking if you guys do enjoy these player reviews please drop a like it helps a lot maybe support the patreon you don't have to maybe subscribe if you yeah you should do that or check me out on twitter and also, most important out of all these things, there are a lot of players to review for this week in the team of the week. So drop down the highest, like who you want to see next, because I will most likely do that. I got a Giuliano, like I have his uh, one to watch or his Path to Glory or whatever, so that's been upgraded. Planning on doing that. There's a Rooney. There's a lot of players here. So let me know who to do. All right, first opponent. Um, oh, there's a Coutinho, but I don't know. I don't know if I'll do him. There's a right forward. Mesut Itzel, but this guy doesn't have him. I'm just naming players. Nabry, come on, four star skills. You've got high dribbling. Play it back for Surge. Now Surge forward, Surge. Hit it on the right foot. Oh, Schmike, what a save, Schmikey. Surge Gnabry doesn't have great free kicks, but we're gonna hit it with him anyway. Can he do something with it? Not a terrible strike, I promise. Gnabry with the winner. Raphael, here's Gnabry. Play it, great ball for Origi, that is that was actually a perfect pass by my boy, Serge Gnabry. And then we got it to Origi, who I'm really hoping gets another inform because that card will be overpowered AF. Really nice play here, boys. What a pass. Origi for Raphael. Go, Rafa. Oh, Raphael gets by him. Play it for Origi. Uh, it's Gnabry. Come on, four-star skills. Oh, he somehow has it. Past Rudiger. That's a pen. Play it through. Serge Gnabry, that's a great ball. They were playing a really high line, and you can get away from Spaldini. Can't you? Hit it. Oh, he's got a three-star weak foot and 75 composure, and I felt it there. Oh, no. Vardy got by me. Is he going to finish? Great save by Fairman. Oh, my goodness. That was terrible defending. Go Raphael turns away from him. Now play it. For Gnabry, I think he's offside by a little bit. Oh. Wait, was he offside, or did I just... Oh, he wasn't offside. Why did I do that? Oh, my God. <laughs> Oh no, it's Martial. Uh, stop Martial, get out there. Oh, he missed wide. Wow, a lot of missed chances in this match. Play it through. Raphael's through. Raphael, up top for Gnabry. He's on side here, I know it. And he's going to finish it. Nicely done. 2-0. This guy's playing a super high line. And uh, when you have a very fast Serge Gnabry up top, I don't think that's the best thing to do. All right, at the break, as of in a very exciting game. But uh, I would say that so far, Serge Gnabry has been the best player on the pitch. Either him or probably Raphael and I would go with Gnabry with a slight edge at halftime. Gnabry, 1-2 with Raphael. Raphael's gonna play it through for Gnabry on the foot. Oh no, I wanted to hit on the left foot. But uh, he hit on the right foot and he missed it wide. Here's Raphael turns. He's gonna play it through for Gnabry. Can he get on the other side of his man? Oh, he didn't have the strength there. Oh no, 
it's in the box. Martial Fairman tried to save it with his face for some reason. And it just deflected in. It's 2-1 in the 60th minute. We've got to be careful here. Don't want this to slip. Rafael and Gnabry. Now Gnabry has space to run. He's going to run right through the middle. They made a misstep. It's still Gnabry going all the way. Gnabry gets a screen. And that was a beautiful screen. That's so definitely allowed. What a run by Gnabry though. And a good finish. He had on the right foot. So you know it's going to go in. We should get an assist here for, I think that was Raphael. <laughs> he just took out, that was great. Oh my gosh. Here's Gnabry. Gnabry gets by an outstretched leg of Smalling. It's still Gnabry, pass by Uren. Still Gnabry, all the way, Gnabry. Ball roll, hit it for me, left foot. Oh, what a save, Schmeichel. That would have been really nice. Back heel, Raphael to Origi. Origi's gonna pull it back, that's a penalty. What? Nonsense. Play it down. Tiago, back for Gnabry. That's a great first touch. Oh, Gnabry still has it. Gnabry, still with it, at his feet somehow. That's a, he, his dribbling is so good that the ball sticks to his feet. 4-1. This Gnabry card is making me reconsider my life. I mean, the first touch was great, but then got a little bit lucky, fortunate, maybe he's just that good, and the ball stuck to his leg. And then he hit it, and it was unstuck. Temporary sticky. Raphael. Down for Origi. Origi's gonna play it through for Gnabry. It's a great ball. It's room to run onto it, and he's gotta fit. Oh, he's gotta finish that off the post. All right, full-time whistle, 4-1. Gnabry gets the hat-trick. Probably could have had more goals, though, if he finished his one-on-one -on -one chances. Does play a 10, hat-trick, like I said, assist, one, and Rafael, two. All right, now for the second match, I took out Inform Rafael, and I put Timo Werner, because Timo Werner is a very comparable player. Uh, but let's look at, he has lower composure, lower strength, lower, or he has this, I think, a little bit higher stamina, but still not very good. Finishing, I think, uh, the edge, yeah, the edge goes to Werner, uh, but then agility balance, not as great. So I would say this Gnabry card should be a lot better, and uh, we'll see who actually is better. All right, this opponent has Bakambu, well, uh, Inyaki Williams, Delfeo. He has me at the camera. That's great. I have something stuck in my tooth, and... I've been trying to get it out since the very beginning of this episode. I, all I've done is just made it, it suck even more. Oh no, it's a good play here. Bakambu's going to center it. Fairman did enough. No, he didn't because uh, Bakambu got it back. All right, 1-0. whoop de doo Tiago, how is that not a... Wait, was that not a foul? I'm very confused how that was considered to be within the legal proceedings of the game. Oh no, it's Aspas. No, he has an inform. Don't go in the net, please. Okay, thank you. Oh, really? Why did Fairman come out for that? 2-0, we're down inside of nine minutes, and he's an airplane. Play 1-2. The 1-2, Tiago. Werner, 1-2. Back for Werner. Oh, what a defensive effort by Laporte. Play it through. Play it now. It's Timo Werner. Timo, oh my gosh, Laporte's doing the splits back there. Play one, two. Now, Gnabry for Werner. Werner, the burner. W okay. He doesn't have great composure, apparently. It doesn't have as high finishing. Actually, no, I think he has better finishing. And he showed it right there. That was a, he smashed that ball. This Werner costs 2K. And he's going up against a 112,000 coin Serge Gnabry. Right now, I mean, well, okay, in this match, it's 1-0 Werner. Diago, play it now. Great play. Origi, smash it home, son. Oh, what a save by Kaler. Inside. Gnabry plays a 1-2. Play it through. Oh, Gnabry was through. Tiago, Tiago gets there. That is the Tiago. That's why I like Tiago. If you guys need a cam in the Bundesliga, I know he's expensive, but just don't use Tiago as a center mid. Use him as a cam. He does random stuff like that. And he's super skillful. He really had no business getting to this ball. It was just a deflection, but look how he's quick, quicker off the mark than Semedo, and then he's got the finish. Get there, Gnabry. He's lucky. He's going to finish it. Yes, he is, Gnabry. We're just quick. That's all you need in this game, quickness. And uh, it's 3-2 now, and I'm excited. I feel very tingly in places that... Play 1-2. Here's Gnabry. Gnabry, can you get past your man? Still Gnabry. Trying to get past him. He's going to work his way past Laporte. Is he? He's got to just dribble around him. Oh, he's he's made him fall. Someone call a doctor. There's a Frenchman on the floor. <laughs> One, two. Werner. Into Gnabry. Gnabry's looking for a pass. There's no pass on, so he's going to play it back. 
Now we're gonna play it inside. Tiago, Werner, Timo, Timo Werner! Oh, really? Wait, was that off Paulinho or Gnabry? Good Gnabry, still Gnabry. Oh, look at that, that's a penalty. Yes, yeah, so, oh my gosh, that was actually the sickest touch I've ever seen in this game. And the thing is, he, like, I meant to do that. Kind of. Not, not really, actually. Look at this touch by Gnabry. And then Varane is just kind of caught in no man's land. Gnabry was going to get to that. We're going to give him this peno. Only 77 for penalties. Let's see what that means. It means that it'll creep in. All right, at the break, playing pretty well. 4-2, we were down 2-0 early. We showed, showed resilience. The thing is still stuck in my tooth. I can't get it out. Very annoyed. Oh no, Jesus threw. Jesus is faster than us, but he took a big touch and Fairman came out. We didn't block it. Okay, Paulinho, hashtag never dives. Go Rigi through. Still Divac, still with Rigi. Play one, two, inside, up top. Gnabry with the back heel of dreams and Thiago finishes off. Maybe you'll see that in the future if Gnabry ever gets recalled by Bayern. Thiago, great finish, but you didn't get to see that sweet little touch. Oh, goodbye, my sweet lover. Gnabry had a 9.4, two goals, two goals for Thiago, assist, two for Gnabry. Timo Werner had one. So I would say Gnabry, unsurprisingly, uh, he was better than Werner, but we got one more game remaining. We'll see who the true Who's in their true final form? Final match. He's got Lukaku. He's got Inform Sterling, the first Inform. He's got Inform Ericsson, C Money, as I call him. Uh, PTJ Sane. Decent looking squad. He's got De Gea. All right. Oh, he's got the Irish legend, Eric Bay. I just noticed that. Oh my god. Gnabry down for Timo Werner. Werner's looking for a cam or something. Someone to take the ball off of him. Here we go. Origi, Taliso, peace check, patience is key, patience, gets it to search Gnabry, good touch, banged it, oh my goodness, De Gea, it was hit right at him though. Play it inside, Gnabry, can you turn, turn that Irishman, make him do a little Irish Jake. <laughs> Werner and Gnabry, back for Timo, Timo, good first touch, hit it, out your feet boys. That is what Timo can do. Only 2K, boys. Only 2K, and you get some absolute nonsense. I mean, he's really good. He makes some great runs. I would actually say he makes better runs than uh, Serge Gnabry does, and that was such a good finish because it's De Gea in net. It's a tight angle, off balance. Timo doesn't care. Timo just cares about getting that money, getting that paper. Here's Origi. Still Origi. Dancing in the box. Gets it to Thiago. Thiago, five-star skills. Dance around him. Still with Tiago. This guy is afraid of everyone, and he should be. Gnabry in the box. Get it onto the right. Hit it. Ah, yeah, yeah. Origi for Taliso. Taliso is going to play it down. Come on. Counter attack here, boys. Counter attack that boy. Go, Timo. Gets by one. Timo's super fast. Look at him go. He still has it. Just center it in the box. Why did Gnabry run away? Play one, two. Gnabry plays it through. Origi. Divock's gonna lay it off. It's gonna be a Thiago Alcantara to make it 2-0. We this is actually like a weekend league ready team, in my opinion. If you just look at the at the front four, because Origi is superb. Thiago is incredible as Cam. Timo Werner is actually proving me he's he's like one of the best 2K players I've ever used. Then Gnabry's pretty decent too. One two, Timo. Gnabry looking for that run. Oh, plays it to Timo. He wants the back heel. Here's Gnabry. Can you get by? Bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Oh, Rose. All right, at the break, complete domination on our hands. Uh, seven shots, six on target, 60% possession. And we we only have two goals, but we really could have scored like four or five given the chances, opportunities we had. Gnabry gets by one. Still surge. He's surging forward. Surging. What are you searching for, Serge? I've already used this joke in a previous episode. Play one, two. Play it through for Timo Werner. He's onside. This is what Timo does. He's going to finish it too. Oh, he should have finished it. Oh, that's the 70 composure, I think. Timo, one, two. Play it through. Gnabry's onside. Gnabry's got room to run. Run into that space. Hit it for me early. Oh, my goodness. Is that De Gea being great? Is that low composure? Or is that a three-star weak foot? 
Maybe it's a combination of all three. Play it, Gnabry. For Timo Werner. Werner is looking up top. And he puts a... That's actually a great ball for Origi. Go, Origi. Lay it up. Back post. Who is that? Back post. Thiago. What a save by De Gea. How did he do that? Full-time whistle. I mean, it's 2-0. We played really well, but we could have scored so many more goals. Origi gets man the match. He had a 9.5. He had one assist. We had one goal for Werner, one to Thiago. Gnabry had one assist. All right, so in review, Gnabry, three games played, five goals, four assists. That's really good. That shows that he's involved in a lot of different play. Now, I'm going to make this review at this the end quick because I want to sell him so I don't lose all my coins. Uh, he's good. He's weekend league ready. Not worth 112k. I would say maybe I would go for 40 to 50k. Timo Werner, I would say, is pretty close. Not as good as Serge Gnabry, but Timo Werner, I would say, is it's not like he's 50 times worse than Serge Gnabry is. Uh, so it doesn't really make sense to spend that much on Gnabry when you could just go for Werner. The big thing that's keeping him back is the composure, finishing, strength, uh, because he his finishing, like, if you're one-on-one -on -one with the keeper in the weekend league, you should feel like 90% certain that you're going to score. And for Gnabry, I'd say it's more like 75%. But he does get in position really well. He's really quick. He's actually one of the quicker players I've used, like almost at Chucky Lozano, Lozano level, even though... They statistically aren't that similar, but he has such high dribbling and pace that kind of evens that out. So how much have I lost on Mr. Surge? Sergey Surge, I paid 112k. Is he 100? Oh, he actually... Oh, whoa. What? I've actually made money. Oh my goodness gracious, I'm so happy. All right, anyway, boys, hope you did enjoy this episode. If you did, drop that like. Subscribe if you're new. Comment, share with your friends. I'll see you boys next time. As always, don't forget to spare pets.